So this is my 1989 Jeep Comanche MJ. Feel bad, this thing's been sitting out in my project boneyard for many, many, many years. It has a Rocky Road 6-inch lift on it, 32-inch uh, tires. We just put 410 gearing in it when I finally rolled it back in the shop. It was a two-wheel drive. It's now a four-wheel drive uh, with a rebuilt transmission, rebuilt transfer case. Obviously, new gearing front and rear. Um, yeah. <laughs> It'll go to somebody uh, because we're just not going to keep it around. I, I have too many. I've got a 71 Gladiator truck i got to build. I've got way too many Jeeps. Um, my wife's idea is that I get rid of them. As I get rid of them, then they fund into the next project. Um, I guess it's one way to do it. But this, this Jeep truck, um, we had two of them identical. One was two-wheel drive. Like, this one was, was the two-wheel drive, and then we had a four-wheel drive. Um, our idea was to have kind of a build competition that never came came about because we have too many jeeps to do as it is uh, so i just figured i'd showcase as i was getting it ready to to sell um, we noticed when we were doing the gearing we put it up in the air we never really paid attention but the front frame cross member was extremely damaged by the previous owner um, they never addressed it they just kind of hid it um, obviously it's been sitting out in the, uh, in the boneyard, so we never really knew. So as we were doing it, we took the bumper off, looked at it and said, up, oh, let's order one. Uh, of all places, I found the cross member through walmart.com, um, and went ahead and ordered it up and through walmart.com, it was free shipping. Everybody else wanted like 70 bucks to shipped me the front cross member so I drilled out and did everything and uh, went ahead and put the new cross member in it got it all in there um, I've got new grill and valance and stuff coming that I'll put on there before I get rid of it so it'll look pretty decent it won't be the same color as the blue but anybody that gets this I'm sure they'll want to like finish it off uh, but it'll it'll be fully functional brake lights tail lights headlights horn um it's got a three three fan aluminum radiator i just put in it there was nothing wrong with the stock radiator i haven't decided if i'm gonna put the stock radiator back in with the three fan cooling because just like a cherokee the comanches had an overheat issue and so figured uh, go ahead and address that while I was at it, and yeah, that's the 1989 Jeep MJ, and we'll move on to the next project after we're done with this one. Thank you for looking. Have a good time. Copper 204 and Instagram. I'm out.